Hey guys, and what's happening? So I'm just sitting here for a couple of minutes uh, before I have to go into work. I got my, see I got my work shirt on. And uh, just kind of do a little a little chit chat here. Man, it is, it is really pretty outside guys, it really is. So it's like, I don't know, probably lower 80s maybe. Yeah, it's really nice. The uh, pool water you see is nice and blue. It's just really, really pretty, guys. But what's kind of scaring me is the colder nights. Not that I don't like the nights to be cooler, but once the nights start getting cooler, then I know that uh, summer is on the way out. You know, it's always sad. It's always sad. Yeah. So the last... <laughs> how many do I got? I got, I got last uh, five girls... Yeah, I have five chickens left, guys, out of eight. Yeah, so we lost three. But that's okay, you know. Um, it got really, really hot, and I was changing their water every single um, every single morning, making sure they had fresh water, and it was cold, cool water. And I even um, I gave them fruit and cold vegetables, too. But, you know, guys, stuff like that just really kind of happens. Yeah. So the other day, we put, um, let me see if I can show you. We put a swing back in that back corner. Let's go have a walk. Yeah, let's have a little quick walk back there. And uh, let's go sit back there. That might have to be my new spot. Yeah, that might have to be my new spot, guys. <laughs> so uh, work this week has been quite challenging, guys. Uh, I don't know if I'm supposed to talk about it or not supposed to talk about it, but um, I, I got a death threat from work, and it was an associate's relative. I won't say who or what or whatever, but um, <laughs> in all my years working, I'm going to sit in the swing here, all my years of working, I've never, never ever gotten a death threat I'm like so I've been extremely agitated this week um, and what's kind of scary about those kinds of things is that you don't know you don't know people outside of work you don't know what their lives are like and it can be really scary you know it really can be and um, that just really affirms my um, say my urgency to to retire in in two years and keep being very diligent on that plan and get out of where I'm at and and uh, get our property and get moving on our uh, our little farmstead that we want to have I mean being in that kind of mentality that someone would be so mad at you that they would death threat you is very disheartening guys um, the society that we live in just kind of like a disposable oh you you did me wrong so you know we'll just dispose of you it's it's really ridiculous you know that we don't have more compassion um, for other people you know and what's funny about being human is that there are misunderstandings there are instances where people do not understand what you're talking about if you don't say something if you don't stick up for yourself if you're not explaining what your intentions are you know people we're not mind readers we're all human and I don't know it you know that really it really can be quite a scary thing when you because we don't know what these people are like outside of work we I've never even met I met this person like briefly in a couple of seconds I how you could have so much hate for someone you don't even know you know is uh, it's beyond me so um, this week I've really really been I'm trying to be quiet about it and but I really want to want to share my experience guys because I think it's really important so 
um, whenever this type of thing happens to you, um, your employer can really only do so much. So it is really, um, it's really up to you to protect yourself and be aware of what is going on with your surroundings so that um, <laughs> whenever you're out about, um, you know, be looking over your shoulder, but I don't want to live my life like that. You know, I don't want to, I don't have to wonder what, where somebody is or what they're doing or if, if I'm, you know, outside at night, you know, if somebody's going to come up behind me and, you know, do away with me or who knows what, you know, it's just really, I don't, I don't even know what to think about it. You know, guys, I, life is a scary thing and it's getting scarier and scarier all the time that people are you know with all the mental health and issues that people have the our society is not like like it was when we grew up you know it really isn't so I just wanted to share that with you guys I know I've been um, my video has been really short this week because I've been very mentally <laughs> mentally stressed with this whole thing I've never gotten a death threat you know so reacting to that I, I really didn't even know what to say, what to think, you know, and then the more I thought about it when I went home at the end of the day, it's like, man, we live, we live in scary times. We really do. And, um, just protect yourself. Make sure that all of your friends know where you're at, where you're going, uh, what you're doing. And, um, yeah, guys, it's we have to be kind to each other you know I mean not everybody understands everybody 100% of the time and people make you know can change what you say and you didn't say it or you know you know how things get twisted uh, when emotions and feelings are on the rise yeah so I just want to share that with y'all um, yeah I don't even I don't even know really know how how what to handle something like that you know I just been kind of plugging away every day going to work and trying to focus on my job and it's very difficult it's very difficult so that has been my challenge of the week guys yeah and man it is gorgeous out here so I'm sitting in this swing and if I pan around this is a pretty good uh, pretty good view of the yard um, it's it's a lot bigger when you're sitting in a <laughs> in a, a corner to see exactly how big it and how far actually it goes back. So um, we have a pretty nice sized little property right here. But um, yeah, I'm ready for no neighbors and I'm ready to retire. So yeah, we're still the plan is still set in motion. We're still looking at property. So. Sooner the better for me, you know, sooner the better is what I say. So I'm just going to leave that with you guys and um, yeah, so guys remember to be kind and love each other. You never know what somebody's going through and um, make sure that people understand you and if you don't understand them or, you know, we're not mind readers guys and if you think someone made a mistake to you talk to that person you know it's just I don't know I don't even know what else to say <laughs> so I'm gonna leave you guys with that and thanks so much for watching guys if you like subscribe uh, give me a thumbs up appreciate it and y'all have a really great Thursday look how beautiful it is out check it out man it's gorgeous out here yeah I'm sitting in the swing just kind of relaxing the boy is behind me doing his sniffer and stuff <laughs> so yeah we're having a relaxing moment before work, and today is Thursday, guys. Go out and enjoy yourself. All right, we'll talk to you later.